ball winner of the first race here amongst Grange, the four-year-old mare's maiden. She was impressive, Kilana, uh, Imperial Monarch. Yes, yeah, she was. Yeah, and some of the last time she, that's the first winner I think Imperial Monarch had. Um, there she's smart filly. She she jumped well, travelled well. The two pulled along way clear. Um, yeah, we like to come on over and job done. It's your local track, and it's always very hot races here. Run here, the four-year-old races, and um, like you said, they pulled a long way clear, and they're two nice mares. But your one, she's a fine big mare, so she should be a nice horse going forward. Yeah, they listen. She's about 16, 61, but probably maybe sixty-one and a half. Loads of bone. Um, she definitely have a good future on the track. Um, we bought her in the Land Rover for thirty-eight thousand, and she'll probably end going to enter now next Thursday after yeah. the sales. Very good, and you're having a very good year. You, you've had another winner already today, four year olds uh, yeah, they, down we, in Ballynow. Yeah, we're the winner in Ballynow, we were second in Arizona, so they're running well. And touch, we have four or five, six, maybe four or five winners, four year olds so far. So we're having a good year, and we maybe have a few more left. Plenty more four year olds to run, have you? Yeah, there's probably another 10 or 12 that are still at to run. There's probably maybe five or six nice ones, and hopefully, if ground stays safe, we get a few those out. A little bit of rain would be ideal for everybody then? Yeah, absolutely. It's an absolute, there's a lot of horses that haven't ran. Um, but listen here, it's, it's still early. If, it's, there's no, if a small bit of rain came, we'd probably be safe enough still. I suppose it's, it's common knowledge. If you're going well, Barry's going well. So Barry's having a great year again as well. Yeah, yeah he's here. He's going well. Listen, he's, he, he's riding well. Um, the two of them are actually, actually Rob. Rob's swimming, flying yeah, as well. Yeah, he did there yesterday. Listen, they're, they're great lads. They're good, they're good jockeys. And uh, if they stay injured free, they're going to have a good season. I was up in the yard with you the other morning, loads right now, but as well as that, well, I know everybody seems to say it, but and staff is very important and you have great staff up there. Oh, they we've great lads, listen to see you. We have James Kenny there, you and Jordan Gamford. James was a winner there a minute ago. Jordan was, he's after having five rides, he placed on three. You and James is going well. Um, you have to have good staff to make these foils. If not, they just to go through the gallop you want. If you make a mistake there, if you want, your race is over. That's good. Well, listen, best luck for the rest of the season. Thanks, Dave. Thank you. Barry O'Neill, winner of the first race here amongst Grange on Kalana, four-year-old mare, trained by Colin Ball. She was good today. Yeah, Dave, she, she's, a, she's a nice filly. Um, we talked plenty of her like, before. She did everything very easy uh, at home. Great jumper, which is uh, today. Um, she, did, she did it the hard way as well. Um, she bounced out there upside the front and jumped very well. And She fended off everything at the top of the hill and Harley and Harley's mare, uh, James Dyle's mare, came at her and she had to fight off her as well and she was, she was very good now. She, she'd be a nice one to be looking forward to, yeah. yeah. The two of them were very tough, they went a long way, you went a long way clear to the third then as well? Ah uh, yeah, two, two very smart mares I'd say, two very smart mares. And that's a first winner for Imperial Monarch as well? Is it? Yeah, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't know that, but look, this one seems, to, if, if the rest of them are right like this one, uh, they'll, be, they'll be smart. And Colin said she'll go to Aintree now next week, and she's a very smart looking filly as well, isn't she? Yeah, um, a lot of people said that to me even when we went out to the parade ring. She, she's a fine filly, which, which she is. Um, look, that's the plan, all, all being well, that she'll head to Aintree next week. Very good, and Barry, you're enjoying another very successful year. Plenty of winners this year. Yeah, look, uh, tipping away, um, tipping away, getting a couple of winners here and there, but uh, like when you're, working, when you're working for the likes of Colin Ball, like, which is which is the head man, like, like the, it's, it's a great position to be in and I'm very lucky. So hopefully get your, uh, keep going the way you're going and uh, get three in a row with the titles then. Oh Jesus, that's a bit early now, they have to be Number talking something like that, but look here, we keep the head down and we keep, keep booting, try, try booting in a few winners and we'll see what happens after that. This is your local point to point, huge crowd here today and it's, it's a great venue, isn't it? It is, yeah, in fairness, like the hunt of the work very hard here to, to get everything right and uh, look, it, it, it's, it's a little bit special too to uh, to get a winner over here, uh, like there's a lot of people Number out five. here today that, that I, I know and they'll be cheering me on and wishing me plenty of luck, so it's, it's, it's nice to get a winner over here as well. You know? That's good, best luck for the rest of the day then. Thanks, Dev. I'm joined by James Doyle, winning handler of the four year old Geldens race, Israel Champ and Milan horse. She was very impressive, James. Yeah, we're very impressive. Well, we taught a lot of them before we came here, anyway, but you're here with us. Here, about 11 runners in it there, sure here, there was another 4 or 5 lads thinking the exact same and sure here, we, we, we're coming here confident anyway and sure here, paid off, we got the results and we're more where, than happy. Where did you buy him? 
He was actually um, a derby purchase. Um, Harley, the Hatchie Road one, was half a moment there, so we, we bought him out the, the derby sailor. He's about 30,000 or that, so yeah, I think he was well bought now, <laughs> looking on now from the, the, the outside in there, so yeah, no, we're he's delighted. A, he's a fine big horse, fine isn't big he? Fine big horse there, I suppose he's on the top of 16 tree there. Yeah, proper big stay and chase from the maker. And Harley jumped out, made the run, and done the hard was, work, yeah, and, and won impressive. There was, plenty, there was plenty of pace on there, I'm sure he just said here, he, he just went out and he was happy, he settled their way, and he just was jumping from, from fence to fence, and he just said he didn't he didn't want to go disappoint him, so he just he let him out. And you were just touched off in the first race, the four year old yeah, Mary's race, she yeah, ran a cracker yeah, she too. Ran a cracker there, um, and they drew well clear from the third did, as well. I think, it was, I think it was a d decent distance back to the third horse there. Um, yeah, lovely Oscar horse as well. Harley actually owns half or also of me, so he's. So he's <laughs> are doing well They're doing well there, yeah, the two of us there, so yeah. We're delighted with her as well there, though. She probably has done enough to go to a sales coming up there in the next, probably maybe the entry sale coming up this week or maybe the next Cheltenham sale or whatever. So see how they are in the morning. But ground and was well safe there, and they did a great job watering it. So yeah, it's a great track, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, absolutely. I'm believing here. We're lucky here last year with even the hooks as well. Sure. So we said we'd, it's local, and we said we'd come back up again and try your luck. And how about a home then? Many more to go then, yeah, four rows for the rest of the season? Yeah, sure, I suppose there's 15 or 20 there as well, yeah. A few five rows there still to, to run as well, they're just hanging around there. But um, yeah, we've, we've a nice bunch of horses still to, to run before it's over. So, yeah. Brilliant. Yeah. Well done, James. Thanks for me, Dave. Fair play. Thank you.